to a later date or dates, if necessary or appropriate, to solicit additional proxies if there are insufficient votes to adopt the proposals. This is basically saying if we need to push this further to the right, right? If we if we can't make everything happen on this date, which would be May 4th, if I can remember correctly, and sure it is, May 4th, may the 4th be with you, baby. Oh, yeah, Yoda. <laughs> yeah, if you vote yes to this, it just gives them the right uh, to be able to push this to the right, that overall shareholders meeting, so they can make things happen if they want to make things happen. So that's what we're looking at right here. This document is 84 pages long. Personally, I think it'd be a good idea to roll through this document so that we can read each individual piece of this and see what's important to keep in the back of our minds as we're making our, our own individual votes. If you've already voted and you are good to go, rock on. There you go, man. Uh, we're going to look into this AMC shareholders vote first, and then we can dig into some other companies. I do want to roll into Rolls Royce. I've had quite a few people that are interested in that. So I think it'd be good to research the company, see what the potential upside is there. And then you guys can see my personal process of what I look for when I'm researching companies for a long-term position, which is what I think Rolls-Royce would be, or at the very least, a good recovery position. And then after that, I'd, I'd like to dig into Bitcoin. Uh, I am bullish on Bitcoin. I do have a position in Bitcoin. I own about a, a quarter of a Bitcoin. And uh, we can dig into that as well, what the potential upsides are for.